They've entertained us throughout 2020 with their virtual live stream concerts. And now they're back with a special edition of Melly in Hawaii. Mikey standing by with all the details. Mikey. And here to tell us more, we welcome our friend, the beautiful Napua, Greg Napua. How are you doing, sis? Good to see you. Aloha. Doing great. How are you? I'm doing well now that I get to see your beautiful face, hopefully soon in person. Person, yes. <laughs> but I've been, keeping, I've been keeping up with you and everything that you've been doing. Um, but for those that have not been, why don't you catch them up to speed? What have you been up to? I, I traveled to Japan before the pandemic. I was traveling to Japan every month. And so that stopped right away, no travel. We figured out Zoom pretty quick. And I think by <laughs> April, Halal was up and running on Zoom. I think by May, the Japan Halal started in, in Zoom. I got to stay home a lot, which is what I was dreaming about and wishing for. And so, so I'm really, really happy I got to stay home. I got to homeschool my son. I have a seven-year-old and work on some music. I'm starting uh, two new albums. And so some Hawaiian, um, some other hakumele have already sent me music to start working on. And I've been writing country music. So a lot of good stuff happened this year. You also partnered up with the Haku Collective team. Tell us about that partnership that you have with them. We are the champions, my friend. Haku Collective is, a, is an organization that was created by musicians, for musicians, I love that. Um, because so often musician wears like the item, yeah? And so, um, Kimie Minor is the founder, and I have big, big props, you know, big, mad respect for her. Um, she's a young mother, three young children, and um, still finding creative ways to, to help artists. There's something coming up tomorrow night, Saturday. Tell us a bit about that live stream because it's pre-recorded, right? It is. It is. We got together at Workplay right over there in Kaka'ako. Uh, I think it was like June 5th. And Kimie had an idea, great idea, because Mary Monica is coming up. She wanted to celebrate hula and Hawaiian music. What she told, explained to me, like in Imua Lounge feel, like, you know, where it's just spontaneous and people, you know, it's not real structured, it's more organic, where people come up and dance when they feel inspired. There's not like a full set list and, you know, regimented um, lineup. And so she called me to come over and, and participate, which, of course, um, I was thrilled. She's like, will you be on Oahu? I was like, I, I can be on Oahu. <laughs> like, yeah. I will make myself be on Oahu. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, I am excited to actually, you know, see this. And for everybody that was there, it's exciting for you guys to relive this. Now, you guys, we are talking about Mele and Hawaii's first in-person concert, A Night of Mele and Hula. Make sure you guys check out HakuHawaii.com and Napua. If anybody wanted to keep up with you and your accomplishments, what social media account can we follow? I'm on Napua Music, on Instagram, and Napua Greg, on Facebook. I have a website, NapuaMusic.com. Napua, it was great talking to you. Great seeing you. Great seeing that beautiful smile. Um, it's always so fun when we have you on Living 808s. Make sure to keep us updated with everything that you're doing, and hopefully we can do some singing and dancing in person. Very yes, soon. in person. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Napua, we'll take care. I'll talk to you soon, okay? Hello. Thank you. Aloha.
mañana.